Welcome back, everybody. So it's time to jump back into Italy and play a little bit more Florence. Let's go ahead and get started. You're just down to uh, Lower Andalusia. That that's gonna be a annoying to get through to, but I, I'll wait. And then there is you. Colin France. Burgundy shouldn't be that big of a problem. Neither should any of these other guys. It should just be a walk into stack wipe and keep moving. But yeah, I could probably get all of his stuff back, and that might be enough to make him be willing to be integrated. We'll find out, though. So, you. Call you in. The rest of them I don't care about. Provence. I think I'm going to make him spit out whoever I can. Just because then, when that way he's, like, releasing people. Is there an actual fort here? There is an actual fort here. Go there first. Sure, I'll take 800 ducats. Cool, 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 cool. Come on, siege it down. So what I want you to do is return these cores to Switzerland. Yeah, it's going to take a lot. I'm also going to take all your money, at least all the money I can. Oh, fantastic. It's just what I wanted to see. And war reps. Nobody should really care. Should have released Lorraine. Yeah. That'll be the extent of what I'm doing to you. And then I'll make a Provence give up their stuff. Army capable of really stopping me, so I'll just split these guys up. Like even if they get everybody together, I my reinforcement stack rebalances that equation. So as long as I'm actually paying attention, I should be fine. Granted, that that is a big ask for me to not be distracted by other things moving at speed five. I should only have another year to go before I have to go back after the Ottomans, so I need to move. I think I'm going to have to wait on the Ottomans until I'm done with this war. And it's going to take a little bit longer than this war to do it, so... I'd best get strapped in, because it won't be a while. Come on, take them both. There goes Geneva. Keep going. I'm not going to be able to release Lorraine. The money's mainly going to France. So I can just do this. Okay. Now it's just Provence and me. Because I'm pretty sure, yeah, well, High Note and me as well, but High Note's not exactly a huge player. Oh, thank you. It, it's gone. They're all gone. 
They're no longer reforming anything. They're just gone. Do you still have an army? No, so you should be willing to peace out since I'm full siege in you. You'll give me money. No, it's, again, it's mainly going to France. And then you should give the land over to Switzerland. And then this is also Swiss. Yep, there we go. Now I have a relatively loyal Switzerland who's very happy with me. I'll be able to integrate both him and three leagues pretty effectively. So I, I need to take that. I need to take tech. I need to stop be, being so behind in it. Oh, nice. I don't even have them as available rivals anymore. That's funny. They were rivals until I took the institution. Now they're, they're nowhere close. Yeah. Yeah, that's a that's a big jump for me down there. The Ottomans aren't even on this list, are they? Where are the Ottomans then? If they're not on this list. Where are you? Development. They're number six, but they're they don't have the institution, so they're falling behind. So yeah, because there's other people with the institution that must have bumped them down, like oh like uh, Portugal. And Castile. Yeah. Well, Castile, I think, is still larger than them, but I think Portugal... I think Portugal helped bump them. Okay. So I got Castile now that I have to deal with. I don't think I'm going to get Galicia here. Yeah. I mean, I could try waiting longer. I just don't know if it's going to do any good. His length of war is, like, right there. It helps a little bit, but I'm going to get called for peace here soon. The Pope ended up taking over for being the Pope. That sucks. Come on, why do I have more guys being disloyal? I mean, yeah, fair enough. I, I saw it. Come on, just go away. Start peeling back. I, I swear, I don't know where these guys keep getting Malta. Why are you? Why are you disloyal? Because they decreased autonomy and the clergy are upset. Okay, the clergy won't be upset that long. If clergy are no longer upset, are you still going to be giving me problems? Are any of you still giving me problems? No, thank you. Castile's going to give me problems. I, that, that's fine. I expect Castile to be annoying. So I can call in Hungary. I can't call in Austria because he's in another war. Oh, you're fighting the Commonwealth. Okay. And Great Britain and all of his stuff and the Pope. But, yeah. And I don't want to be called into that. At all. I have another, another merchant. Let's have you pull from over here. Okay. 
capped out again. Come on. Let's develop over here, I guess. I'm gonna have so much development in the Greek lands. I better never lose it. Because like it's like all of my country is here with massive all amounts of autonomy. Give me one moment, I need to pause the recording. Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that. What was I doing? It's been like an hour. Okay. Just waiting for this. That's gonna be a while. That's right, I'm waiting to see if I can get that without call for peace pushing me out of the war, but we shall see. If there was stuff I can get from, like, Croatia, I'd do that, but it's not really going to work. Plus, I'm waiting for this to be done so I can immediately go in on the Ottomans and actually get what I want instead of what my allies want. Do I have... I do. I do have a lot more force limit, so... There we go. Do I have... I mean, I do have some. Let's do that. Build the ones that actually make sense. I know. I know, Castile. I know you want out. I will let you out soon. Ish, maybe. I don't want to just. I don't want to leave Galicia, but at the same time, I can't think of a solution that'll get me everything. I mean, this is fine. I don't like leaving them that. I don't like I'm not taking the state, but it's fine. So. Let's go ahead and. Wait, no, I'm still waiting anyway. So. Might as well just sit back and relax. And I have another one of you. Defense principle, military principle. I mean, I mean, why not? I mean, I guess that's actually pretty nice. You have to keep fighting wars, but I mean, it's not like I'm actually losing that much. It balances itself out. And it's, it, that's basically win a war every 10 years? Yeah, win a war every 10 years and you get the Republican tradition you would have gotten back. But you get absolutism out of this. You can pull back on that. I mean, you do have to be a republic to have that, so it's not amazing, but it's fine. How old is Austria's ruler? 17. Don't be a while. did you you've lost reasons to, to peace out how do you lose reasons nothing's changed Fine. all right peace out let's pour all that up what's going on oh karmon all right let's placate you once Let's go after you. Hungary will come in. France still won't come in, but that's fine. 
Let's go for our cores over in the Ottomans. I mean, I... Tunis is still going to be slightly annoying, but I don't think they're going to be that big of a problem. So let's focus over here. Yeah, that's what I wanted to do. So you up here, and then I could put just two just random guys on these guys. Off you go. Oh, France will come in. Come on in, France. You can go deal with Tunis for me. I would appreciate that. I have your capital already. That was really fast. Okay, dog, can you please quit pulling down on my cord? She's, like, laying on my headset cord, and she, like, keeps rolling towards it, pulling my head down. Normally I wouldn't care, but I, I have a feeling that, it, of course, it's me playing EU4. I'm going to be distracted and get stack-wiped on a mountain fort because that's happening, so... I just kind of want it to not do that. Alright, so... Let's see what I could actually punch out of you. Then all of Karaman's cores. And then some stuff for Morocco. Yeah, why not? And that's... That, effectively. And then it's just... Anything else I can take off of him. Yeah. I don't mind that. I don't mind that at all. There's still stuff in Europe, but I... I don't care if he has stuff in Europe. I can take that later. It's not like he's ever going to get across the, the strait again. Of course they did. And France is doing French things. Recall. Once I take this fort, I think I'll go and... In fact, I'll take this stack, or two stacks, and head back towards Iberia. Because I think I need to go and focus on Iberia a little bit more. Just call it a suspicion. I don't think France is handling it all too well. Plus, I also want to go and hit Tunis. Okay, I cannot take more soon, so let's do that. Because I'm still going to get a lot, but at least it'll buy me more time. So I think I take this state, like the actual Tunis, Tunis state. Well, no. Clemson is still around. They were spit out. So there is that. Wait, no. Clemson's down here. Well, I can just flat out vassalize you. I'll do that in a second. But I'll do this. And make you return that core to Morocco. Because it shouldn't take much to occupy Tunis. And it looks like they're handling it. Yep. Sorry, Ottomans. You were having a good run. But you've had a lot of good runs. You don't need more. Okay. Keep going. How about you walk around to that fort? Wait, no, no, where are you going? 
No, you go down here. Go. Oh, Mazab doesn't. Okay. Give me a second for that. I need access. Thank you. That should make it easier. I don't think I'm going to have any more rebels anytime soon out of this area. And in case you guys weren't noticing this, if you look under the unrest, Republican cultural sufferance, it helps. A little bit of unrest reduction, just for being a republic. If I remember right, you have to have a... Like, if you go over here, I don't have um, anything over here embrace, but if I remember right, it's you still get it. You just get it for being a republic. Once you hit kingdom. So it's kind of useful. It's not great, but it's kind of useful. I've already had a lot of rebel problems in this because of that stupid center of reformation. But that helps. Hello, cat. I always thought it was a. Uh, it had to be in your culture group. So I need to look that up because I must be misremembering it. Because this stuff is not in my culture group at all. So. So I can take tech now. Or I can wait. 787, 589, and 679. I mean. If I don't take tech, I need to take an admin idea. I desperately need to take an admin idea. Infrastructure? Diplo rep will help. But that's about it. And it helps with construction costs. But again, that's about it. Religious, maybe. Humanist will make it so I don't have rebels. Which I am a fan of. I am very much a fan of that. Because that is a lot of unrest reduction that they have built into this, so. Yeah. Let, let, let's go with that. Let's... Let's take that tech. The other ones I could just take, too. That, fine. And pick up... Humanist. Upgrade my cavalry. Good. Good. Leather cannons. Yep. That sucked. Peace these guys out one at a time. Sind. Goodbye. Mara. Goodbye. Yemen. Goodbye. Tunis. You're going to be the one problem, huh? You're the problem, child. Come on, take the fort. Don't look at the fort. Take the fort. So if I take this instead... I know those, these guys are all gone. He doesn't have any cores there. This is there, but that's about it. Fazan is still there. Barely. Come on. Take it! You're at 71%.
Ow, dog, please. Come on. Now he's got to take a 7%. Come on. I didn't think so. Alright, let's pull you back. Something stirring with Castile? Ooh, what are you going to do? Who are you going to attack? Are you going to attack me? Ease you out. All that land. Focus it. Con <laughs> yeah, there we go. And over here, we're going to do the same thing. I mean, that's a lot of aggressive expansion, but not much overextension. Let's, uh... I'm taking a, an admin idea, so let's hand this over to Karaman. I'm already going to have enough lack of Diplo power, or enough uh, lack of uh, admin power, so let's hand this over so I don't have a major problem. And then I can use him to convert it later. That works. You can just sit here and stomp them out because there will be rebels. There are going to be rebels. Let's uh, vassalize you though, if we can. Am I excommunicated? Doesn't look like it. Oh, I can't core it because it's too far away from the coast. Okay. Let's proclaim a guarantee. Oh, Galician Uprising. Okay. Let's annex you. And then I can also annex you. Once I actually have points coming in, oh, I can revoke that guarantee. You're useless. <laughs> yeah, Commonwealth is done. They're they're not recovering from this. Okay, Tlemcen. Let's influence you. Uh, Hungary broke their alliance. Why? You want my land? Yeah, you want my land. Austria, it's Royal Mary. You hate Hungary too, so, I mean, there's that. Pick up an alliance with you. I have way too many people. Okay, Hungary, let's pull back on that military access. Squish. I kind of want to keep the conversion speed, so that'll be maintained. Yes, more admin power. More admin power! I mean, with this guy being a conqueror plus more years of separatism reduction, that could actually really stack up. So I have, I have several years until I go after you again. I just got done with the Ottomans. I need to go after Tafalot, because he has a bunch of cores, but I want to go after him once I have Tlemcen as a vassal, because he's bringing in Tunis, and if I'm going to be fighting Tunis anyway, I would like to have him spit out Tlemcen stuff. Okay, let's go ahead and do this. I mean, harmonization speed does not help me at all, but that unrest reduction certainly does. All 
Alright. Let's uh help him convert a little bit too. Because, I mean, that's exactly what he's doing over here for me, so... Him converting this land is making my life a lot easier. The one problem is, is that now that Hungary's out, I can't use him against the Mamluks. Austria will come in, though. How much more do I have with you? I'm like capped, aren't I? Yeah. So let's uh do everything else we can. Let's offer access. I can give you subsidies for 15. Is that a, a thing I need to be worried about? Yeah. Sure. Go fight him. Go get him. Go get him! I'm still trying to deal with becoming the controller of the Pope. I mean, this isn't exactly a huge thing. Neither is that. It's not huge. No, oh, you're in a coalition, huh? Who else can join a coalition? Not Castile, he has a truce. Portugal, he can. I'm excommunicated? Stop that. Just seriously, knock it off. Ah, there you are. Okay. So it's just, if I attack you, I'm now bringing in a coalition is going to be annoying because that's the Pope ah. mere trade power so, who else would be likely to join this? I have Tafalov's close, but not quite. Portugal is effectively there, but he has other things he's doing at the moment. Burgundy is there, but yeah. Then there's the Ottomans, who of course would want to join, but now can't, and neither can Hungary. Is Hungary at the point? No, nah, he could never join. So I don't know who's the third that he's going to go for, but... At least these two so far. Yeah, there's Burgundy. Because you hate me just for a lot of reasons, but definitely because I took your land. Well, I took a lot of people's land. You're going to have to get over the fact that I took a lot of land. Oh, there's Portugal. So I think I'm going to have to chill out for a bit, because apparently people are really mad. that up. Keep converting. Go deal with him and you go deal with him. Oh, he's already taken care of that one. Kind of. that. Nam looks, you're probably my biggest issue. I can also do Hungary, so let's go ahead and rival Hungary. He wants to be a problem, he can be a problem. Everybody hates Hungary! We can all get along! There's no reason for us to not get along, we all hate Hungary! It's like NATO, modern day, we all hate Hungary! <laughs> If I go after you, it will bring in Portugal, which will knock out Portugal. Then there's the Pope. 
I, I really don't want to take the land of the Pope. I don't want to deal with the, the penalties of owning Rome without the Pope. It's just, it's not worth the time. When do you expire? 1630. When does my truce expire? 25. Okay. That's fine. Alright, Plumption's slowly moving himself into range. Again, I could subsidize him, but I... Yeah, let's go ahead and subsidize him, just get him done, because I don't want to have to influence again or any of that nonsense. So let's give subsidies, maximum amount of money. It's going to spike. Now I vassalize you. Fantastic. Now I just wait another month and cancel those subsidies. There we go. Congrats, you got like 120 ducats out of me. Hope you think it was worth it. Because I certainly do. And when I attack Portugal, these are Plumption cores, so I can just take them from him too. Plumsenny? I don't know. Something like that. Pull that back. Okay, Burgundy. I mean, I don't think I'm going to get you out of the coalition. I think I could probably get you to stop being quite so outraged. Maybe. But it's going to take some effort. Like, it's going to take a lot of effort. Ugh. Leg hurts. Influencing them costs 600 ducats? No. I mean, I might do it just to bump them up over 50. But that's that's going to be in a couple of years now. Castile's the Pope. My uh, Pope is the Castile. Yeah, the first one was right, but still. That's annoying. Pull back on you. I have a bunch of military power I need to spend again. Uh, is there anywhere here? Yes, there's some. Not much. Because I've kind of tapped out on the whole spend it in Greece thing. Because, yeah, I'm spending it in Greece a lot. Keep converting. Cool. Eh, I don't care about Rudrusa. Okay. So you're still annoyed with me. And you're rival to my you're allied to my rival. But honestly, I don't mind. You can just be your ally to him, I don't care. Let's, uh, if I guarantee you, I might be able to do this if I do this right. Let's guarantee you. Let's scornfully insult Tunis. And then let's influence you. You're over. Yep, there you go. You're not threatened by me, but you're not outraged by me. Will you peace out of the coalition then? Come on. No? Alright. There, you're an ally now. You're an ally of mine. Get out of the coalition. Okay. You are out of the coalition. So I will dissolve that alliance. You're out of it. Portugal. You're kind of the same thing. I mean... I can scornfully insult you. And then just influence you. Oh, you're a great power. That's a problem. I mean, I could send you a gift, but I'm pretty sure that's going to be expensive. Yeah, that's going to be really expensive. Yeah, proclaim a guarantee. 
I guarantee you, Portugal. I guarantee you're not going to like what's going to happen if you don't get out of this coalition. Oh, you're like right there, man. Come on. Give me the money. There. Two opinion reasons. There you go. Will you get out of the coalition? Alright. There's an alliance. And then I dissolve it. Pope's out. He realized it's a bad idea to, to stay there. There goes Provence, and then it's just the Mamluks. I mean, my problem still remains. I have to fight all of this, but... Once France is out of a war, I could probably ask him to prepare for war. No, I need to ask him to, to hate the Mamluks. That, that's one part of it. Can I not? I mean, there's reduced opinion. Oh, that's right, you're at war. Duh. Some Mamluks. Mamluk. There you are. That'll make you not like him, hopefully, as long as you accept. I'm losing a little bit of money, but that's fine. Losing a little bit of money didn't hurt anybody. I'm well aware it hurts people all the time. It's fine. So, Russia's the big problem, because Russia is also going to be in this. So when I attack you, it's going to be... It's going to be like World War Europe, huh? Like, no matter what I do, it's going to be a mess. Like, I want to hire more troops before I do this. And move them all into position. So let's... Let's get them moving. No, I need to move you via ship, huh? Where's the other one? Why can't you get there? Oh, because I can't get past Hungary. That makes sense. You won't be helpful. I don't think anybody's going to be helpful other than what I'm already bringing to the table. Okay. I do not need this guy. Let's see if I can find a lower cost. Because I'm not taking tech anytime soon or pushing an idea or anything like that. Okay. Thanks, France. I guess we're not attacking now. Oh, there's there's Castile. So let me hear where I'm attacking him. That that's happening. That that's happening like now. So because I do not want that coalition. No, 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 no. Uh, that means I need to bring you over here. I need to bring you guys can do that. So. You there. Fact. Give me a second, I need to pause the recording. Sorry about that. Wife was going out and she was getting ready and I kept hearing her cuss behind me. So, before she started really cussing and started getting loud, I figured I should probably pause the recording. But, at this point, I, I did see when I went to pause it that it's been about three hours with the recording, so that's more than enough that I need for the week, so I'm going to have to actually end it here, because if I push it to the end of this war, I have no idea how long it's going to take. So I think at this point it's better to just end it here and then pick it up next week. So I will see you guys next week. I hope you guys are enjoying this so far. Thank you guys for watching, and see you guys next time.